I'm going to show you how to unleash the fullest potential of your CPU in today's video and many more tweaks to gain more FPS and reduce input delay. And if you want to support me so please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel so let's get straight into this video. Gear Up Boost is one of the best programs for the optimization of your ping while you play games using your wired or wireless connection. So get this paid program free from my description and play your game with lower ping. So first go to my website, I give link in description and download the FS Boost pack. And as you guys downloaded the program successfully, just simply drag it onto your desktop and double click on it. And as you can see this new install here pops up. And now we can see God that it's got Show on us a exactly which CPU we running. For me it's AMD Ryzen 7370X with 8 cores and 16 frets. And as you can see, my stock for speed is right now 3.59 GHz. And now here on the top, this is where the magic happens boys. Here we get the CPO settings for power profile. And we're just simply gone. Click on this drop down menu and go to Bitsum. Highest performance. This is the best mode guys by the way up. You can use whatever you want. But the Bitsum highest performances give you the maximum amount of FPS. And as you can see, everything got already changed here automatically. We don't need to apply anything for ourselves. And obviously, you don't want to put in like a low power mode here on because we just want to boost it to the maximum just to sum this up real quick guys um this program does automatically determine which are the best settings for your cpu and as you can see it's gonna adjust the boost settings here all by himself and just simply click here on apply and the new settings have been applied but what i would also recommend you is to enable the bitsum dynamic boost since this is like a better power plan than the high performance one we already enabled in previous tutorials just gonna read it out real quick this handy feature forces the pc to be on bitsum highest performance power plan while active but the lowest the CPU, the more conservative power plan when it goes idle. And what is this pretty much? It's gonna boost or apply like this new power plan. You guys which we have to set up here again. I and disrupt them and yes. You can see when the people use the bits. In highest performance one. And we're just gonna be gone. Press here OK. And then here OK. As well and as you can see. The new power plan has been applied guys. This is always gonna make sure that your CPU and your system or wall is running at 100% to gain the maximum amount of FPS and yet just of less input delay and all that stuff. And we now actually take a look at our power plan list. We can see that the Bitsum highest performance power plan is enabled provides Bitsum optimized CPO performance. This is truly the best one you can get out there guys. And I'm gonna leave the link to this program. Obviously in description. Everything so can reread it for yourself. And with that said. We already done here with this first step. And let's continue with the next step. And as a next step guys, I'm gonna recommend you the GR Boost. Which you can trade for absolute. With the link in description. Just make sure that you launch the tool. And select Fortnite. And it's gonna automatically find for you. Best DNS server in or near. For the least amount of latency. As you can see I only get 11 milliseconds latency. Which is giving me already. A huge improvement of over 100%. I've been using this for any game. When playing here right now on my PC, and the best part about it is, it's also searching actively in the background, while you're actually playing for the best DNS service. It's consistently also showing you the connection between your PC and the router in the router in the actual game server so therefore, as mentioned, make sure you check with the link in description. And just to double check that our CP is really running at 100%, I'm gonna show you a second method. And all you guys have to do is simply go in, search and type and run, until you find the run application. Just simply open it up and in here type in mask and fix. Just simply written out like this. Just simply press OK here. And the new system configuration window here should pop up. And if we go over to boot, we can see now that we get the advanced options here for our current operating system. And yet just simply opened up here. Advanced options. And then we see your number of processors. Usually it's just on one here. Just simply put the check in here. And now you can put the maximum amount of frets. And since I'm running a 8 core 16 fret CBU, I can put it all the way up to 16 guys. And this is exactly what I would recommend. You simply put the highest number possible in there to just make sure that your CPO is running at 100% and all the cores and all the extra fats are utilized always. And then just simply press OK supply. Press OK again and now it says you on that. You should probably restart your PC. Everything to apply correctly on. You can do this later and I would recommend you to just watch the rest of the video. So you apply all the steps and then restart your PC. But you can of course also do right now. But I'm gonna do it later so yeah. I'm just gonna press your exit without reset and yeah. This is it for this step and then for the next step. We just wanna make sure that all the temporary files are deleted from our system. So we can free up the space and just make our windows run a little bit faster. Which is also gonna increase our performance in game. So guy, And all you have to do is simply go into your search. Van type in present or 10% or until you find this first file here. Just simply open it up and as you can see in here. Now we've got all the temporary files. Windows saves over the time on your PC. And they're super super unnecessary. Because there's all like some old information for like backups or stuff like that. Or whenever you have something updated on your PC. And what you guys can do is simply delete all of that. Since all these files are actually straight up. Running in the background. Because as you know if Windows is like 
trying to open up something on your hard drive um it's always utilizing all the files and scanning first of all what is actually all on your hard drive um so therefore they just get open up and it's gonna slow down your window and also gaming experience so therefore please just make sure to delete all of these and as you can see some of them can't um he deleted right now because they're right now being used to save some information like my creative cloud which is in connection with my adobe premiere pro or here my logitech have or stuff like that um there's literally no issue with that. Just simply make sure to delete like once in a while. And you should be chilling with that as well. And you got this as a today's video. If you enjoyed, please don't forget to leave and subscribe to my YouTube mode so so much. And maybe consider to check out my other guides. On my channel, I've got tons of other guides where I already show you how to boost even more. Overclock your GPO, overclock your monitor and all that stuff guys. Maybe you want to check it out. Maybe you're interested. If you still have any more questions, feel free to ask me down in the comments. I try to answer as many as possible. And with that, have a great day. Have a great Whatever day. Whatever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace.